In the monastery Vrasevsnika on May 6, 1818, on the assembly of the people provosts, at the proposal of Prince Milos Obrenovits, princes of Nahias, decided by acclamation that Kragujevic be the capital of Serbia. At the time, the city had 193 houses and was safely distant from Turkish garrisons with favorable geographic position and homogeneous population. Two factors decisively impacted the economic and cultural development of the city. The development of the military industry propelled Kragujevic into one of the most significant cities in Serbia, while the proclamation of Kragujevic, the capital city, was a turning point that initiated the overall city development and the foundation of the institutions that represented the base of Serbian statehood, the scientific, cultural, and educational development of modern Serbia. The rule of the Obrenovic dynasty and being the capital city was very beneficial for Kragujevic. A newly erected complex, except accompaniments, including the first cathedral with icons preserved to these days, Prince Miloš Mansion, destroyed in a bombing in 1941, the Princess Ljubica residence, where she lived with her children, and Amijaz Palace, the last remaining enclave built in Balkan Oriental style. It is in these buildings and their vicinity that the new history of Serbia was created. It was here that Dmitri A. Davidovich, Prince Secretary, wrote the first modern constitution in 1835, one of the most liberal constitutions of the then Europe. The oldest court is founded in Kragujevic, the first lyceum, the forerunner of the university, the first Serbian grammar school, the training of the first apprentices and school teachers, the first theater run by Joachim Vujic, the first professional orchestra, a Prince Serbian band, the first school of painting, the first gallery and museum exhibitions, the first singing society, the first school of dancing, the first pool, and the first lottery. And the first Serbian newspapers were printed in Kragujevic. The city had the first pharmacy, and the country's first light bulb was switched on at the arsenal. Kragujevic was the first city in Serbia where a ball was organized. The Milishev Venets is a starting point today for guided tours by an increasing number of tourists from Serbia and abroad in visits organized by the tourist organization. Although the city is recognizable for the memorial park of Shumaritsa and an old Fiat 600 that fans organize an annual festival in honor of in June, no citizens of Kragujevic would allow visitors to leave and not hear stories about the glorious past or without a visit to the most attractive tourist localities and places to have some good fun. The story of Kragujevic has a long history. Traces of life in this area date back from the Stone Age. Archaeologists have excavated an entire settlement of 26 houses and a large central building in Divostin village in the vicinity of Kragujevic in the last century. Seven anthropomorphic figurines were excavated from neolite in the shape of a face of Vinci's figurine. Divostinka is today a unique destination of the city of Kragujevic. Kragujevic was mentioned for the first time in Turkish writings under the name Kraguavja in 1476. It is considered that the name of the city comes from Kragui, a bird of prey that lived in the forests of the area until the 20th century. Positioned within the beautiful environment surrounded by Rudnik, Sunive, and the Gledits Mountains, Kragujevic has excellent conditions for hiking and climbing. 
A paragliding club provides the opportunity to fly over the colorful Shumadia. Active holidays often include horseback riding or a carriage drive through Shumadia for the visitors and tours of equine farms. Eight kilometers to the west from the downtown of the city is the geographical center of Serbia, and the complete beauty of the area can be experienced in the heart of Serbia. There are two medieval monasteries in the vicinity, Drasha and Divostin. Drasha River Gorge, the hill of Rujevica, where three out of 30 protected mushroom species in Europe may be found. An integral part of student excursions, apart from visits to cultural and historical sites, are visits to the first public aquarium and the botanic garden on a 16 hectare site. One of the favorite destinations of an increasing number of Kragujevic citizens is the lake at Chumaritse that provides a number of recreational sporting activities and water sports. There is the first adventure park in central Serbia with a zip line 260 meters long and numerous restaurants and catering facilities. If you want to hear how the heart of Serbia beats, then you should visit Kragujevac. The city that resonates with Daira is still faithful to traditionally excellent sound of the smack. The University Center, where several thousand Serbian students are educated, typically has excellent parties till the early hours of the morning. Prince's Arsenal is a unique site in Serbia and an excellent venue for the Arsenal Fest, organized every year at the end of June, visited by thousands of fans of good music over three festival days on several stages. Shumadia Fest in October and Vibe Fest in September are additional festival events. You cannot leave unless you taste delicious Shumadia food or taste famous domestic Shie Vovitsa at one of old city traditional restaurants served by the hospitable Shumadia population. Numerous city cafes, restaurants, bars with live music and specialty acts provide for an excellent time. Kragujevic is a city rich in history, tradition, culture, sport, and entertainment, and awaits for you with open arms. If you care to hear the whisper of your beloved on the bridge of love, or the sound of steps on the bridge of snobs, close your eyes and take a deep breath of Shumadia, and do visit Kragujevic. Welcome to Milos, capital city.